this is um, Ubuntu on phones. So it's basically the core of Ubuntu that's now also running on phones, and we uh, designed a new interface to optimize for small touchscreen uh, devices. What you see over here is a uh, personalized visualization of your data. So it gives a very personal touch to it when you uh, open your phone. Uh, the other important thing to notice is that um, it doesn't have any hard key or soft key buttons. And the reason is that the whole experience is designed around the edges of the screen. So every edge has a specific purpose. So for example, when I go from the left, I can launch my favorite apps really, really quickly. Uh, I can also go to the home screen right, right here, uh, which basically unlocks the device and goes to the home screen. Home screen has my, my own stuff, my frequently used apps, contacts, my content. Uh, when over, here, over here you see my people. So it's like uh, my my contacts, my, my favorite contacts, uh, Facebook contacts. This is my music, the music I just added, uh, music I can buy. And then we go to the other side. This is my running apps, uh, also frequently used apps. So it's my, my full apps page. Also all my installed apps. So the launcher has my favorite apps, right? And this one has all my apps basically. And then over here you see music. So uh, oh, sorry, video. So uh, video, uh, my, my recorded videos, but also videos for downloads. Things. Um, so, what's really cool about uh, Ubuntu is that we have both web apps, so for example Facebook and, and native apps. Because uh, for certain experiences like gaming or media, you kind of need a native experience to have a very high performing uh, experience for users, right? But for some areas, you also can have a web app, for example Facebook, and I can show it over here. And when you go, for example, to people, um, the really cool thing with uh, our web apps is it's fully integrated into the operating system. So for example, see here status update for uh, uh, from Facebook, I can click here and basically it goes to the browser immediately. Um, also, Facebook messages are integrated in our messages as well. Um, the other thing is, um, besides web apps, we also have native apps as set for media. For example, when you have thousands of pictures, you want to have a very sm smooth experience. Um, so this is the, uh, the gallery app, building QT, basically, or the resigned. And, and the idea behind it here is that um, we designed it such that the experience is fully optimized for uh, content. Uh, so there are no controls in your face all the time. I guess, I look at my pictures, even the header goes away when I start scrolling, right? When I open a picture, I, I still don't see any controls, and when I want to do something with the picture, I can bring in the controls from the bottom. So for example, edit, or share, or share for example, and I bring it back here. I go back to the picture. So this is what the bottom edge does. Uh, we also notice that when people are using apps, sometimes they want to change settings, right? So for example, I want to change the brightness from the off screen or change the volume, Wi-Fi. Now rather than going back to the home screen, finding the settings app, we provide a very quick access to uh, settings. And this is from the top edge. So I can pull it down, messages, sound, networks, battery. So for example, battery, I want to cha change something for battery, change it, bring it back up, I'm back in my app. Super fast. And also, for example, when I go to messages, bring it down, I reply to a call, for example, or reply to a message, bring it back up, I'm back in my app. So that's what the top edge does. And the last, ad, the last thing is the right edge, and it basically allows me to swipe very fast between different apps. So we, we basically uh, saw that many people use, swipe a lot between the last two or three apps. For example, when I go to the camera, go to the camera, right? Um, and I want to go back to the gallery now, you just basically use the right edge swipe. Or when I want to go back to Facebook, use the right edge swipe. I want to go back to note, Notes. So basically it allows me to quickly go bet between, uh, between different apps, basically. And back to the home screen.